Your Excellency, Dr. Jalila Bint Al Sayed Jawad Hassan, Monsieur le Ministre, cher Jean-Yves Le Drian, cher Christophe Castaner, Excellencies, distinguished ambassadors, ladies and gentlemen, dear friends and partners. It is a great pleasure and a true honor to welcome you today for Vision Golf 2024. I want to thank the Ministry of Europe and Foreign Affairs and the Ministry of Economy and Finance for the support. Last year, 800 stakeholders from France and from the six GCC countries gathered here at Bercy to attend our first ever business meeting dedicated to the Gulf region. This year, even more public and private have answered the call from Bahrain, Kuwait, Oman, Qatar, Saudi Arabia, and the United Arab Emirates, you have traveled far to join us today, and I want to thank you warmly for your presence here today. It is time of turmoil and uncertainty, and it is more important than ever to build bridges and partnerships. That is what we will be doing today here and over the next two days at Vision Gulf. We are here because we are all keen on building upon our synergies across all sectors of activity. Sustainability, industry, healthcare, artificial intelligence, infrastructure, retail, green energy, sport tech, and of course, tourism. To our friends and partners from the GCC, I want to say this. The French companies gathered here represent the best we can offer in all sectors. Their world-class expertise and global track record speak for themselves. They are ready, able, and willing to help to achieve your ambition. To the French CEOs present today, I want to say this. If you want to do business with GCC partners, there is no time to waste. The Gulf countries are moving forward and upward at breathtaking pace. The time to seize this incredible momentum is now. Over the last year, I had the opportunity to witness it firsthand. During COP28 in Dubai, where the UAE showcased a high level of ambitions in terms of energy transition for the world war to see. Business France was very proud to give French startups the opportunity to present the cutting edge solution to the entire world. And in Riyadh, where His Excellency Franck Riester led the business delegation numbering 120 companies organized by Business France, Medef International, and France 2030. Also during the state visit of His Highness Sheikh Al Thani, Emir of Qatar, who announced 10 billion euros of investment in France. And during Choose France, where Gulf companies had a strong presence this year. So the opportunity are there for the taking, both here in France and in the Gulf countries. And the bilateral and investment relationship between France and the six Gulf countries is strong. It is based on shared values, on mutual trust, and on a common drive to shape a better future together. And precisely because we share such strong bonds, I believe that there is still room for improvement. We can do much more. On the one part, Gulf countries are committed to ambitious diversification strategies and far-reaching reform programs. And on the other part, France is investing massively to transform its own economy, make it more competitive, more innovative, more attractive, and more sustainable. Thanks to the France 2030 investment plan, amounting to 54 billion euros, a new France is taking shape. We are ramping up our effort to position our companies at the forefront of the global economic cooperation. Those companies are here today. Meet with them. Talk with the CEOs. They have much to bring to the table, and they are eager to show you what they are about. Ladies and gentlemen, I wish you interesting conversation, fruitful discussion, and stimulating meetings. I wish you all a great Vision Golf 2024. Thank you.